created now to Hawaii and those devastating wildfires. You can see just how much has been burned to a crisp. The death toll now rising to 55 people on Maui's island. More than a thousand homes and cultural landmarks destroyed or damaged, including an entire historic town. ABC's Melissa Adan reports. A race to contain the raging wildfires racing across Hawaii as the death toll rises. The blaze now the second deadliest in U.S. history over the last century. Officials now fearing the death count to grow over the coming days. As some people jumped into the ocean to save themselves, this man doing just that after battling flames for three hours. And I ran to the ocean and just I gave in. Everything. Gone. Emergency doctor Reza Dinesh rushing into the historic town of Lahaina with his mobile clinic to treat burn patients. It literally felt like an atomic bomb went off and survivors were coming out. Aerial footage showing what's left of Lahaina, the one-time capital of the Hawaiian kingdom that has deep cultural roots, much of it now gone. People lost everything, homes, jobs, their cars, some their pets. There's still people missing. I've fought wildfires in California, and I've never seen something ravaged so fast. Many homes and businesses reduced to rubble, burned out holes of boats washed up onto the shore. We have a scar on the face of Maui that will be here for a very long time. President Biden issuing a disaster declaration for Hawaii. Anyone who's lost a loved one whose home has been damaged or destroyed is going to get help immediately. While weather conditions have improved across western Maui, gusty winds still persist as firefighters work to contain all three fires still burning on this island. Melissa Adan, ABC News, Maui.